miss with that overhead could have turned around this whole tie break. Some real conversation three, about nighttime Williams. tennis at the U.S. Open, Chris, because historically they've always allowed the women who play two out of three sets to go first. And there have been plenty of times when the guys are waiting around, not taking this court till about 11 o'clock at night. You can make that argument. That's not fair. It's not fair to the guys. There's and been this, some talk that could be yeah. well, changed this, a little bit. After this match, first. after this match, believe me, it's it's a, you know women are making equal prize money. Make them wait sometimes. Why not? I, 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 I can't think of. I mean, again, this is a this is a good example. There was a, a long celebration on the court beforehand. That was lovely. And now this match didn't get on till when? Huh? They got on it like after eight, right? Mm -hmm, sure. And this could go three. It's already been an hour thirteen. The first set's not even decided yet. This could really start some conversation. That's a nice serve right into the bottom. Fault. Oh, no, another, oh, no. That's the fourth pen. And what it's if, with the lines judge that when Venus was up the other end, she didn't hear the call from. So she's front, asking which foot. Yeah. She's really annoyed with this gentleman. Well, that's by far the biggest of the four foot faults. That was a jamming serve that was going to give her set points at 6 3 instead of second serve now. She's waiting for the breeze. Five Williams. Williams. Sixty-four miles per hour. So much tension in that second serve. Venus has to shake that off. Back on serve now. The men of the hour on it before the match. We'll hear from Andre coming up. Remember when he was a punk? 20 some <laughs> odd years ago. Andre's <laughs> flashing back to some of the many tie breaks he's played on this court. 6 5, the The turnaround, that foot fault, leading to the double fault. Shabin has won three straight points. He's serving down set point. as we go uh, back inside and back to Chris. All right, Hannah, thanks. 15, Venus, 14. a couple of break points in the opening game of the second set. Only once has she ever lost a set in her opening round match here at the U.S. Open. That was way back when she was 17 years old in 97. Won the last two sets, 6-love, six 6-1, six and has made the second week here every single year that she's played the Open. 97 was actually the year she got through to the finals as an unseated player uh, playing in her first U.S. Open, the first time it was played on this court. Six, 
13-14. Really, she's got to make do. She's hit more forehands than backhands in this set. She's been lethal. Dushavina didn't have a single forehand winner. All of her ground stroke winners have come from the backhand side. Damn. It's well hit in the break for Venus to open this second set. As well as Dushavina has played at times. What might be playing in her mind if she tries to close out this match, Mary, is she has exactly one win in 27 tries against a top 10 player. So <laughs> it's kind of uncharted territory trying to close out a top player. As you can see, the folks pulling up the lawn chairs and the now pedestrian mall that is Times Square. If you haven't been to New York since, they've changed Times Square into pedestrians only. It's it's something interesting, different. No, no. The world meets right there in lawn chairs and <laughs> stares at ticker tapes and screens and signs it's hot it's and each other <laughs> yeah now we'll see if Venus can consolidate the break it's New York City's version of Hedman Hill <laughs> don't send me there <laughs> come on Pam come on Pam they got the naked cowboy guy there they got all kinds of people for oh, you to okay. interview <laughs> <laughs> now you're into it But so often when Venus has gotten a break and she got three of them in the opening set for following service game. Error filled. Yeah. I mean, welcome to her summer. And and the thing is, if, if she's got patella tendonitis, what you're supposed to do is not play on. You're supposed to sit on a couch, eat Cheetos. Sort of what Rafa did after the French Open for nine weeks or so. I don't know about the Cheetos, but he didn't. He didn't play tennis. Right? You must obey your body when it when it's got tendonitis. You know, you can try anti-inflammatories and you could do some kind of stuff. But um, Richard Williams wanted his kid to just sit down. Richard said, "I told her, don't practice so hard. Save it for the matches." the court and into the crowd where you can keep it. The guy just he just said you mean I have to give it back. Actually he doesn't you're have supposed, to give it you're back. supposed to be able to keep it but Vera wanted it back. She didn't know the rule here I guess. He's allowed to keep it. Should I tell him now. Yeah <laughs> get out there Pam. Yorkers would refuse to give it back. <laughs> well, they've been ill timed those double falls, five of them. It's it's been it's been hard. Can you imagine trying to return Venus to serve? Dushavina is returning from there on first and second serves, crowding. This court. Hard to get a rhythm against Venus. That was buried halfway down the net. And once again, Venus is broken back. One down. Second. After breaking her opponent.